January 2025, a six million dollar Chinese AI just humiliated America's hundred million dollar models. Wall Street panicked. Nvidia lost six hundred billion dollars overnight. But here's what the headlines missed. The AI race isn't just about who builds the smartest robots. It's about who controls the future of everything, from your job to national security. And right now, America and China are burning through money like it's going out of style. The US is spending three hundred twenty billion dollars in 2025 alone. That's Amazon, Google, Meta, and Microsoft combined. Meanwhile, China's government is pumping $100 billion into AI, with a strategy that makes Silicon Valley look uncoordinated. First battleground, chips. The US controls the design. NVIDIA owns 80% of AI chips. But here's the twist. We banned China from buying our best stuff. Result? They got creative. DeepSeek just proved you can build world-class AI with inferior chips. Oops. Second battleground, power. AI is hungry. We're talking 100 65% increase in electricity demand by 2030. China builds nuclear plants and coal facilities at warp speed. America? We're still arguing about permits. China produces over 10,000 terawatt hours. The math isn't pretty. Third battleground, brains. China has 47% of the world's top AI researchers. They're churning out engineers while we're, well, let's just say Jensen Huang is worried about losing 50% of global AI developers to China. So who's winning? Plot twist. It's complicated. The US still leads in breakthrough models, 40 major AI systems created in 2024 versus China's 15, but China's closing the gap fast. Performance differences that were double-digit in 2023, now it's basically tied. And here's the kicker, 83% of Chinese citizens believe AI will benefit them. In America, only 39%. They're more optimistic about our own technology than we are. But here's what everyone's missing. This isn't just US versus China. It's about who sets the rules for the technology that'll reshape civilization. China China's betting on state control and efficiency. America's betting on innovation and freedom. The winner? Maybe it's whoever figures out how to make AI work for actual humans. The AI race is far from over. China just proved that throwing money at problems works differently than we thought. America's still got the edge in creativity, but China's got the edge in execution. The real question isn't who's winning, it's whether we're all racing toward the right finish line.